All right, you got beaver trouble like I do? Well, this is what you got to do for it. Chicken wire is not going to cut it. This stuff doesn't work. So you need to get something heavier duty than that chicken wire because I'll just pull it straight down as you see my beaver did. So what you'll need is you'll need to get welded wire. And I'll put that under the description. There's a link for it. You're going to need to get some zip ties, some bolt cutters. I'll put that all in the description also. And some stakes if you really want to secure it to the ground because sometimes they'll lift it up to get in there to get to the tree. But usually they'll pull it down like that. But this is going to be hard for them, so they're going to go after it and try to lift it up. So I'm going to stake it down also. Okay, first thing you want to do is unroll your welded wire here and make it a circle as you unroll it to the about the size you wanted around the tree, which you wanted about a, a good six inches to a foot extra around it. The, you know, like this is the tree in the middle. You need this distance here from the edge of the tree, about six inches to a foot, because they're gonna push on it. They're gonna try to get in there, chew on the tree, no matter even if you put that up. So make sure you give yourself a good gap. Then you're gonna use your bolt cutters and just cut it. Now, once you cut it with your bolt cutters and you've got it all set up and nice and round around that tree where you got it set up wise, put your gloves on. If you hadn't put your gloves on already, make sure you have them on because this wire will poke the dickens out of you. You're going to wrap it around the tree. All right, once you got it around the tree here, going to cinch it up. Make sure if you have extra wire on here, try to wrap it around, loop it a little around the uh, the edges here so it'll, it'll be more secure. But you still got to tie strap it. Tie strap that sucker good. Every level, put a tie strap. And then down here, you're gonna put your stake in. I've already put one down here and I've got one set up to go in. Typically I put four around. As you see right here, I have about a six inch gap between the tree and the fence. So it's gonna make them work for their money there. And if they get through that, then I'll make it a foot, you know, a foot wide. So I'll add another six inches. And you can just take this apart and put a link in between. And you can do it that way or cut yourself a new piece. Either way, it'll work and keep these beavers out. But make sure you stake it to the ground. These guys are strong and uh, don't mess with them either because they're territorial and they can actually kill you. So. <laughs> Be, be leery around uh, beavers, they're pretty dangerous. But that's about it, folks, it's pretty easy. Just, you know, you need a hammer, some snippers, a bolt cutter, uh, some good, you know, welding wire uh, fence. And uh, that's, that's pretty much it. And I'll leave the list there under the description. And you should be able to get this job done and keep your beavers under control. Good luck, God bless, works for me.